and hello on a very stormy Sunday afternoon in July. Been having a lot of this bad weather recently. Uh, this is Dave from Dutch Tents UK. This is a very quick video about this um, interesting Rebuta well, kind of dome tent thing. Um, it's just been absolutely pasted with um, with rain. It's gone through a real heavy downpour. I mean, there's just well, the sun's out now, but I'm trying to show you puddles, and it's drying off really quickly. Um, but it's just had a real soaking, um, and I'm glad to report it's extremely waterproof. It's a poly cotton material, and it's yeah. On the in, well, on the inside, let's go and have a little look. It's difficult to, to see a dry tent, isn't it? But I assure you, that's bone dry. Um, so in a way, I've got some real puddling down here on the storm skirt. In fact, I'm going to unpack that front wall and clear that. And then repeg that again. Um, so this is, I mean, it's quite a lightweight tent. As I said, the material is poly cotton, and it's. I, I bought it because I've seen quite a few of these before um, on Mark Platts, and I've seen a few being used. Um, but I particularly liked the blue on this one. I think it's a really, really gorgeous blue, and it's really tall as well. I mean, I'm. Well, for I me, mean for a dome tent, you don't find dome tents this big. This is a proper four berth. It's got a zipper at the back, so you can access. You see inside the tent there. So you've got two access points if you want. And um, despite the strong winds, particularly last night, it's been up overnight. It's been really good. Inside here, we have a large fitted ground sheet that's pegged down and then inside we have a sizable um, sleep pod um, I am pretty confident that will definitely take two double air beds or four singles so this is a proper four berth tent for two people it would be just luxury you'd have loads of space and even for three even for a family with small kids this tent will go nicely in the back of the hatchback so out here we've got some um, a nice bit of usable space there and I'm now standing up completely head height and I'm not anywhere near the ceiling. Outside we've got that nice usable space there. So we've got a bendy pole tent which connects into a metal um, star shaped system there we then have a pole runs across the roof and then two poles to come down for the door um, we've got windows here <coughs> that are velcroed in we've also got extra windows here that are vents so they unzip from the outside so it's it's nice and easy lightweight pretty easy to chuck up and um, just a really good easy camp tent really and inexpensive this isn't going to be going for multiples of hundreds of pounds you'll be glad to know I'll be going to my Facebook page yeah I'll show you one of the curtains so we unzip and we have a mesh there mesh window zip down all the zips on this tent are good the canvas is good all the storm skirt is good Everything's good, really. There's no, um, there's no, there's no damage. Um, it's used, so there are. It's not. There's no major stains. A little bit of a stain there on the inner tent, and I noticed on the door. Again, a few user marks, but really nothing on the inside here. It's generally a little bit one in the corner there. Generally inside here, it's really nice and clean. And it's, it's a lovely space, and although it's flapping around a lot, of course, being canvas or poly cotton, it's, it's really, really quiet. 
You don't have that horrible rustling crisp packet. So I've put the table and chairs in there just to sort of give you an idea of the sort of space of the porch. Quite usable. Family of four with a table round there is going to be difficult to be fair. Um, but for two or three, this tent is absolutely brilliant. Um, packs down, there's the bag that holds it all. So it's, it's, it's a fair weight, I would say. The packed weight of this tent is probably around 12, 13 kilos. And the pack size is probably, the bag I think is 50 to 60 centimetres long. And I think about 30 to 40 centimetres across. Um, so, but it'll fit, you know, it'll fit in the, in the boot of a, of a small uh, car. So, um, now just in the time I've been uh, making this video, the canvas has already turned a different colour because it's dried out. So of course it's only the outside of the canvas that has any wetness on it. So when it starts to dry, it starts to dry really, really quickly. And now the really strong winds have gone. It's just fluttering a little bit. Really, really nice. Anyway, that's it really. Um, yeah, so I'll check out my Facebook page. And if you're interested in a nice, in a nice little weekender, or even, I think even a good, a good deep camp tent for two or three people, um, well, if you're interested, then uh, give me a shout. Thank you very much.